and welcome to this new Wigby show. On the kitchen table I have a Sony amplifier receiver, FM stereo, FM AM receiver, STR-AV270. I got this and the information is that it's open and I'm asking what's happened with it and the answer was I don't know a very special answer um, here a pack of something and here a pack of the screws and what is here a pack of the screws okay and interest wise told me the information that this amplifier don't work hmm <laughs> <laughs> a very funny information and um, what shall I do with this information I can do nothing <laughs> so um, we have a watch inside what's happened and I also got this uh, this is also <laughs> a used one amplifier chip <laughs> you see that this is a SDK SDK 4162 two, number version 2 stereo amplifier. There is a monolithic um, stereo amplifier built in one, a, a hybrid. Yeah, it's a hybrid. It's built in one module, and maybe I should change this. Mm. Is it the same? 4191, 4162. Mm -hmm. It's a different, I see. Hmm. Oh, yes. have a look that situation I would like to switch this on and hope so it comes and make a click make it a click mm -hmm. so we're doing it on on and poof nothing uh -huh. it's nothing doing nothing the display went to the radio yeah and Normally should be click. Should be click or not click? This is the question. Normal after a few seconds we must have a click and if it's not so we must measure what's happened. We're doing the voltage measurement and hope so you can see this. Hmm? Important that the viewer also can see this. Aha, uh -huh, yeah. <laughs> not so bad not so bad uh, we measure from the ground um, I hope so the ground is here in the in the body of the metal case and we measure to this resistor here and we have 30 volts DC that means look here 30 volt DC that means uh, there is no AC that means the, the upper side of the amplifier is have a short circuit and we must measure here maybe also have 32 volts mm -hmm. 18 volts uh, it's a sync defect and so the amplifier don't start to switch on in case of that that uh, it's burned in must be around zero volt here yeah zero volt on the output should be zero volt ah, okay but i must ask about the uh the ic it's a wrong version maybe we can build it in or not i must have a watch on the plan let's have a watch to the plan Service manual. <laughs> Go to the service manual. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now we have the plan here from the STR AV 270X. Okay. <laughs> it's a oh, it's a UK or E model. What is E? Espania or Europe? I don't know. What's happened? Oh, we have a watch on the inside. What is this? This have a phono inside and CD tape and video with 50 kilo ohms impedance and 150 millivolts of voltage. It's the it's the potential speakers A and B 
No power. Need uh -huh. interest. <laughs> no written how much power. Oh, here it is. The 230 watts and 30 watts. Aha, uh -huh. interest. 30 watts and 30 watts. So what we would like to show is uh, the plan. Where we have the plan. The plan is here. No, it's it's here. Mm hmm. What's happened here? In this plan. Switcher uh, power, 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 and the power power amp IC six hundred one. It's here. It's the IC six hundred one. Well, okay. And here we have a uh, thirty volts plus on pin ten. I mean, it's hardcore. <laughs> Maybe we might have a uh, uh, the regulator is defect, and we have now minus voltage. Plus and minus, and they are in between. But in normal is the IC defect. Let's have a watch on the IC. What is this here? Power supply IC. No, 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 no. This is the switcher. Here we have the the power amp. Maybe this is the power amp. No, this is a a board. And after this board. We have the amplification inside this, okay, volume board. Mm -hmm. And after the volume board is coming the power board. And after the power board is coming nothing. Mm -hmm. Interest. Maybe on the next side. There are ICs. This is not that what we need or don't want. No, it's nothing here. It should be back. We must go back to the to this. Here's the voltage. I mean, okay. If they say the power amplifier is the IC six hundred one, then they must show. We must show what's the SDR. And the SDR is uh, maybe here because this the the. The issue of this plan is this, this is not a PDF, this is a scanned picture, so you cannot search on it. And so the the IC601 is where? Okay, IC601, here it is. This is a SDK4162. Mm -hmm. 4162, okay. Is it built in or not? I don't know. Must have a watch. But the interest wise this I see I have it a second. Yeah, I have it built out here. It's a four one six two type mark two. Okay. This is the IC what has happened here and this is a other IC. It's the four one nine two built in. This is normally for the 371. Mm -hmm. It's the same IC. Okay. Should I build it out or not? This is a big question now. What we're gonna do in the next step is that we would like to disconnect from the power. I put this out. And uh, we would like to change this old IC to the other old IC. Maybe. It's okay. <laughs> Maybe we can uh, turn this around to the top. Aha. Uh -huh. Look here. It's a we open up this here. This is a good construction. Look this. In case of that that it's only one part. It's stamped out and it's this part what was here from the same material is here now built in. This is a, a good idea to making a, a good body case. Oh, my camera is going warm after a hot hour. This is okay. Needs a it needs a break like me. Ah 
Oh my gosh, this is uh, this is the screw mafia. <laughs> I think so. They have a contract with this organization. Uh, it's only a joke, you know. We must. Ah, here is also in the way. We must also do this. Disconnecting this feed. And now, oh, here, here we are. And here and there are uh, a lot of screws. Remember that. This is our little. And now, ha, super. Now it's open. But, <laughs> oh, what I found out is now. The IC is under this <laughs> metal thing, mm, so we should open up this here. Maybe we must uh, open not only this, we must also open the, the other side with the coiling fan. Aha, uh -huh, interest. It's a shorter, they have shorter screws here. Uh, don't, don't change them. I think it's not so, not so. Not so intelligent to change them. Oh my, my horror is coming. This and the other side will be uh, connected to the print and hold up the print because here and here are also screws from the cooling mechanism. And they would like to give away. We must give them away. Uh, what I measure is also this um, doing the reconnecting it again. And what we measure was here, you can see, I put it in the sun uh, too much. <laughs> so I hope so I can you can see this. I insert the main supply. And here are four points. You see that? These are the capacitors, the big ones, yeah. In the middle is the ground. You can see here we have a zero voltage. Near zero. It's around zero voltage. And uh, here we have 22 volt. Okay, plus. And here on the other side from the capacitor we have minus. 33. <laughs> it should be 32. It's the same. This is a symmetric power supply. You have minus and plus. For the sinus wave, the sinus wave going up and down. And so you can see that the supply is correct. I think the IC is defect and we must um, disconnect it from the mains. And um, we are turning it back to the other side and disassembling the screw but the screw was not correct installed here the it's not correct it should be in another way installed maybe they have the long screws here there is the second And now I must going back to uh huh interest. I cannot move the the thingy here. These are maybe we must put that out. Okay, we must put that out. I lose one. Hmm. This is not so intelligent, but hmm, what we gonna do? Take this and look. They put a they put a a holder a pin in. Yeah. And now I can change the I can change the thing and can't give it that out. Aha! That is important, but we must bend them a little bit. I mean, hey, come on! <laughs> Super. First they think uh, 
that we can do this or I mean how you can repair this now I'm searching this pin it's jumping away I found it on the floor my roommate should be clean up here but I have an invisible roommate here <laughs> and now we desolder this I soldered this first in case of that uh, the point is that um, if the old solder has no uh, consistency to desolder it, yeah, so I cannot. Is it disconnect? Yeah, okay, correct, super. Now uh, uh, a big flash will come if I'm on the supply. No, I solder only the single pins and I hope so. That doesn't happen. No, I must um, solder one pin after another, and uh, the thing is that normal. You should uh, uh, discharge this with a resistor. Um, yeah, but. <laughs> I never do this. <laughs> and normal people do this, but I'm not normal. <laughs> and uh, you can fix it up. Other ones are doing the screwdriver and making a short, uh, but uh, this is uh, so it's a horror for this condensator, for this capacitor. I'm sorry. And uh, yeah, <laughs> I I didn't do that. So I'm taking now my special station and would like to desolder the pins from this SDK monolithic hybrid IC. Now I'm connecting to the to the ERSA. This is the ERSA, the VEC 6500. Wow! 70 Watt, uh, 180 Watt. I don't know what is correct. Ein Pumpe, four seconds, uh, eight seconds, and whatever. Yeah, uh, we have the. This is the pump. Uh huh. Doesn't work. Doesn't work. But why? Ah, I see. It's a. It's a issue here. Oh my gosh, a big issue. No, it's only the, the hose. The hose is now here not so good and so on, blah, blah, blah. And the go you see that the golden days are of this time was over, but it's a super, it's a super, super thing. I mention it, I don't mention it. Um, I don't have this. <laughs> I don't know why this is turning around. Hmm. We must start here. No, it's it's not it's not ready. What if you don't have a machine like this? What are you gonna do? You can solder each point by hand. And this takes time. <laughs> but this is a super machine with the whack. So I think it's finished. But now we have the problem where should I put the tool? I put it here and turn it off and uh, we must have a special tool for this. This is the special tool. I must clean up all these here. These small balls from the solder should not be fall in the electronic. I don't like this. Because now you can see the, the thing. Uh -huh. Here we have a 
or connection. Mm -hmm. We have a connection here. That means this pin will be not desoldered correct. And <laughs> these small balls are irritating myself, are irritating me. Mm -hmm. No. No, 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 no. Hey, come on, what's happened here? I would like to go out. <laughs> Normally it should really fall out. Look, it should fall out. You don't show out. You are a beast. This is a beast. And why they ah so oh my gosh it should be fall out but it doesn't fall out. Okay. <laughs> I think these two pins are holding the whole the whole stone. Yes. What can I do? I take the other soldering iron. Would like to open up these pins with this desoldering thing here. Aha, uh -huh. it's too cold, it's too cold, too cold for my contract, too cold for my operation. I mean, hey, come on, it's now close, how that can be? Ah, crack. You hear that cluck? It's making tuck. <laughs> ah, it's hot today. You cannot believe. I cannot make a film if it's so hot. It's 30 degrees plus here in my room. And I have the window open, but what shall it be? I mean, if it's so hot, I cannot think. I cannot work. I cannot do nothing. So. Now, what are we gonna have here on this situation? Oh, hey, here is the SDK4191 stereo amplifier. Look at these banded pins, and it's defect. We disconnect it here and here. And now we must clean that. It's it's not that what we want to see. We must clean it. And um, and so, what is this for a blue pasta? A toothpaste, maybe, huh? For brushing. Look at this blue one. Ah, I never see a blue one. Maybe it's a super for power supply for the. Look, uh huh. But how we can fix this to bring it in inside the inside the thing. Look, also this blue. What happened with that blue bastard? I must clean the original new one. I think this is spilled out. But we must uh, make a clean and then we can install it again. And we need another pasta. It's happened now. 
is the, the thing that I would like to clean this up with this special tool. Oh, what's going on? Nothing. Aha, uh -huh, okay. I think it's not empty, but it's not empty, but it's defect. And sixty-two. I clean this up, and also this should be very clean in case of the new compound. Here we have the thermal compound and now I would like to give them ah, oh my my dear what is this it's not okay it's gone easy it's easy going we put that here <laughs> <laughs> okay is that enough yeah I think it's enough it's more than enough girl stayed here and put it away and now you can see it's coming out everywhere if I position it here with one screw I hold this in the higher position and put it here. Aha. Ah, oh, it's hard. And okay, we must. You can see it's come out everywhere and we must clean that in case of the dirt is then everywhere. Also we should clean it under it. Look here, here. Not good for the trousers and for something. So we must clean it here too. Hmm. And this, take the paper and <laughs> Very funny. Doesn't work. Not so funny, but how we can fix this problem? Uh, it's it's quite difficult, huh? Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, it's okay. It looks like okay. Ah, oh, two pins are bent. This is not nice. I hope so I can bend it back without a break. Next one step I would like to move this up and insert into these pinholes but it's very complicated. I mean how do you do this in a factory? Can I do this in the factory? Because the pins are bent to to uncool. It's really not cool. Why do you bend it? 
Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's crazy, huh? Or should we deinstall first the chip and then on the no it's so it's in this direction and now I have the problem. I cannot see the pins. Not like in this position. We must install it in the other position. This is uh, for me too. Oh, it's too. It's not good. I do that in that way. What's happened here now? It's the microphone here. I mean, what do the microphone here? Tell me that. It should be on my my clothes hmm i think i put it here and now i'm have the light in the way what is this hmm it is interesting no <laughs> i need a i need a lamp in case here is totally light and now I need a lamp. In that case. And what I think the the pins are in, but now I have other problem. I say the pins are in. It's not really correct. There is one pin, it was not in. Hmm. How I can pull them in? I need a, a very small screwdriver to doing this. This one. I take that one. And I must. Analyze that this pin should be in. I can press this in. No, I must build this in. No, the pin bends back, bends back. I don't know why. Bullshit pin. Maybe it's too fat, this idiotic pin. I must desolder it. Look, I must desolder this bullshit pin. Maybe they are too fat for the holes. You know that? If something is too fat for the hole, I know this. I mean, how that can be? Also here. I don't know why. I must reorganize the pins again. turn it mm. around and I think this uh, this IC is also defect to give me a defect part I think this is defect why that should be correct so I'm soldering these pins now you can see that under this condition is super.
Soldering is super, no problem. But to come in, don't make a short. You don't come in, you have the problem here with this part. Uh, I, I think if it's a new part, you don't have this big issue. You can only look here. It's also the 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 solder joints are not so well anymore. It's okay, but and now we have a watch, but we must call the camera. <laughs> it's a defect. Hey, now I fix all the thing, and now we must cross the finger. Do not here. Close the finger and signal is coming. Click, it's making click, and a noise is here. Ah, this is called tuning. No, this is hand tuning. Super. <laughs> the tuner is not so not so good with my cable. Here is the special antenna. <laughs> it works, but I'm not so happy as I start this tuner. Well, this is the tuner, and believe me, you can change this potentiometer and this one, and here this filter, and this filter, and this potentiometer. I don't know what they're gonna do here with this tuner. I never think that tuner is so bad. No, it cannot be. Can not be. <laughs> I mean, this radio station is not so extreme strong, 10 kilowatts or so, but I remember that I can receive with a normal radio a noisy signal here, but not so extreme from outer space. I mean, this is unbelievable. Look at this. FM mode stereo, it's a stereo signal inside, but a lot of noise and don't know why the noise is coming and why they have so much noise. I think somebody is uh, turning the potentiometers here. I changed now, only by hand. Now it's better. And here, and in Zoom, the machine is working, and I'm making a test with an audio, with an audio um, from a CD. Uh, take a paper and cleaning up this machine a little bit because in case of the fat and the dirt and so on and like to do this look and it's from smoke or something else cleaning up this a little bit and this <laughs> this is okay for this machine and here Think it's working? Mm -hmm. yeah. 
next layer, next song. I think it works. And well, this was the Sony STR minus AV270. The amplifier hybrid I see was the fact I changed this and we can listen this is working again. Uh, the other system was fail in case of the, the, the output of a DC from a 16 volts or 18 volts and uh, the DC controller stops the connection to the speakers um, in case of that this is the protection for the speaker that the coil of the speaker is not burning I hope so the speakers are not defect in that case so if you connect a amplifier from a defect amplifier again to defect speakers then oh, you also have the problem that can be going wrong and yeah if you like my transmissions please subscribe and or sponsor me at patrons and I say thank you for watching <laughs>